This week, lawmakers will debate new regulations for utility companies like American Electric Power. We're working for you following up on your complaints about high electricity bills. 10 News reporter Tommy Lopez has more on why AUP says everything is working OK on its end. Hundreds of people have voiced complaints on social media about their electricity bills, saying that they're not sure why they're as high as they are. We heard from 1,500 of you after our story last month, and we're bringing your concerns again to AEP as people are questioning their most recent bills. People showed us January bills with up to $200 increases. A petition to investigate the company now has more than 23,000 signatures online. We went with AEP electrician Dee Bryant to see how they test their meters. They test hundreds each year. More than 99.9% .9 are working as they should. If we determine that the meter is accurate at that point, we'll start looking for other things that could be driving their bill up. Those causes could be anything from inefficient water heaters to poor insulation to the emergency heat coming on, which can use four times the energy. The heat pump should be left on automatic so that it will work like it should and use the emergency as a backup if it needs to. And frozen heat pumps can increase costs. Spokeswoman Teresa Hamilton Hall says because rates haven't changed, higher bills mean more energy used. We certainly understand their concern. We know that bills are higher this time of year and it's tied to the energy usage. During a recent cold snap, AEP found homes needed an average of 85% more energy for heating than during the same period last year. You can call the AEP customer service line to have representatives answer questions about usage and bills. And you can find out more about new payment plan options and how you can lower your energy costs online at WSLS.com. In Roanoke, Tommy Lopez, 10 News, working for you.